that's the difference between CPMs, RPMs, and EPMV. They are actually quite different, and knowing the difference is vital to improving website revenue. You can think of these three metrics as a pyramid. CPMs are the foundation of that pyramid. CPMs are the advertiser cost of putting a thousand ad impressions on a page. RPMs are revenue per 1,000 page views earned by a publisher. This is a measure that is calculated by dividing estimated earnings by 1,000 page views. A website's average RPM includes the cumulative total of all the CPMs on the page views used in the RPM calculation. EPMV, or earnings per thousand visitors, is the total revenue earned per 1,000 sessions or visits. EPMV accounts for the impact of UX on revenue, like multiple page views during a single visit. This gives you a clear picture of the revenue a site earns per visitor. It can account for the impact of an ad causing a visitor to bounce, thus limiting the total revenue they could have earned had they visited multiple pages. RPM simply calculates total page views, so doesn't account for the value of each visitor. In this example, you can see how an article with a higher RPM actually generates less total revenue than the article with a lower RPM. Why? The landing page with a $10 RPM averages a higher number of page views per visit. If you only focus on RPMs, you might think the other landing page generates more actual revenue, but you'd be wrong. That's why EPMV is the most accurate way of evaluating how much a site earns per visitor and why it should always be used when optimizing a website instead of RPMs or CPMs.